Hi everybody, it's Julie and I'm here with my crafty fall extravaganza and this is Happy Mail that I will be sending out for a swap in Swapper's Corner. So stra extravaganza is a large swap and this one has six um, items that we made and so this is what I made for my side of the swap and so let me go ahead and show you so everyone has to make a pocket letter so pocket letter is nine um, trading card size ATCs or eight artist trading cards inside of a pocket protector like you would use for baseball or um, some type of trading cards. So I've added a tassel to mine that is on a paper clip. She can take it off and clip it onto something. I actually in the fall have one of these on my purse. <laughs> um, so the first little pocket I made an ATC. I used this cute little squirrel note um, notepad and I just cut it out. I fussy cut around it. Um, added a label. There's some washi tape behind here, some bling, some leaves that came off of this. And I got that in the, the village, you know, the little Halloween and fall village section at Michael's or Joann's or somewhere last year. Um, and then I added some of the little faceted bling. This one um, is a card, and then I've put a cutout, a die cut here that I had in my stash, a, ha a piece of gold doily, some more washi tape, the word hay rides that came from uh, a fall paper that I had, and a couple more of the leaves. Here we have background paper, a piece of sparkly scrapbook paper a little playing card with the cute little guy and the flower I just thought he was so cute and he did make me think of fall because that's when we start getting mice in the house yuck um, some leaves some washi tape here and the bling there so come down here we have harvest again the washi tape the bling and uh, leaf and it's on one of those die cuts here I used my favorite um, lacy punch, and then I um, tore out from one of my scraps of um, fall paper the word beautiful, and here we have another one of the little squirrels, and this one um, I also fussy cut around it, and it was from a little notepad. Another one of the die cuts here, um, corn maze and pumpkin some leaves and some bling all words that make me think of uh, fall uh, maybe the my fall bucket list is corn maze and hayride is on my bucket list harvest um, here we have the word autumn some bling and leaves cute little fox and then this is one of the scrap pieces that was left over after I made the flip book We have a die cut, some uh, more of the gold doily. So there's a little here and a little here. This, I fussy, or fussy ripped this piece out of a scrapbook um, page that, um, well, I had used the page on the back here and it still had another little pumpkin. So I put it and put it here. Um, we have the label, the word fall, some more of the leaves, and some bling. And, and then what I did is I put these two cards close together, glued this on, cut it so that it kind of goes over the two um, cards. So that is my pocket letter. And then the best part about a pocket letter is you turn it over and there's goodies. And there's actually a recipe that was... Pocket letters were um, inspired and introduced by Jeanette Lang. And um, there is a recipe for them. And it includes a note to your 
um, pen pal about a little bit about yourself so that's here here's my note and I went ahead and stamped on it um, it also includes like a tea cup of tea or a coffee bag or um, you know something some kind of drink beverage for them to be able to drink while they're they're looking through your items and then you might add um, I have some metal pieces here so there's eyelets and paper clips and buttons and maybe even some bells a miner on a candy can have a little canning jar like a mason jar and then tied with some string at the top here I have some bling a paper clip that I made and an very vintage used card with the butter churner and the little lantern there. I just thought it was kind of cute to add. Um, here we have a paper clip that I made, one of the flat paper clips. And then several stamp words. And the Happy Fall is out of my stash. Um, I did um, stamp this one. We do not remember days, we remember moments. Um, there's a little piece of scrap paper, uh, pumpkin spice and everything nice, cozy fire, pumpkin spice and everything nice. You get a little pumpkin and fall is when nature turns to gold. So those are some, uh, some words fall words okay. and a paper clip and the paper clip is a ticket with some washi tape the word beautiful and some bling and then some of the yarn and I fluffed it on the outside there so here this pocket has um, some of the die cuts that I had and then a whole bunch of these little words so fall words apple picking cuddle hot chocolate acorn scarves fall boots hot tea blankets harvest and on and on okay so this pocket has some little tags that I cut out with my um, use my Hobby Lobby punch some ribbon so a couple of leaves and a flower and a butterfly um, sticker. So there's that pocket. This one has it's the tea and it has a little tag that says a cup of tea. This pocket has um, some of the cutout hearts. Here's some of the squirrel notes, some of the squirrel notes with the sunflower. This has washi tape and then some of the Georgia eyelash trim. This has a little wreath made out of those little leaves on wires and some green hearts and then some fall hearts that I cut with my Cricut. So that is the pocket letter and I just fold it up like this and we'll put it over here. So next you are to make either a flip book or a flip bag. And this time I made an envelope flip book. So the envelope measures a little over five, so like five and a quarter inches by seven. Five and a quarter by seven, okay? And I use some of uh, the scrapbook paper for the front here. One of the cut apart for there. And then um, I have some, uh, they're four by four squares uh, that are in my stash. And I use them throughout. So this is one of those. And it has a flower here with some washi tape holding it. And this gives you a place to journal. You could put a picture. Um, I liked this cutout. And it has some, has three tags inside this pocket. And so this, this tag has the ribbon and the ticket. 
attached with a staple. And then these are just, um, they have the little strings inside of them. So I thought that was fun and I like to have this one in front of the flower so that when you pull it up it goes whoop, you got a flower. Okay, so in this pocket we have several things. So there's several of these cards that I had and like that. And then this one is a card with an envelope. So you could put a picture on it and journal um, the same with these. So that just gives you a bunch more things. And it's right here. And as you can see, the, remember these were envelopes. It was three envelopes put together. So that was one envelope. And then this is has a tuck spot and we have a wood grain tag. We have this large tag with the pumpkin um, stamped on the back. And then we have this that says a wonderful autumn. And a Rolodex. We do not remember days, we remember moments. And then this that says daily details and they're both stamped with the pumpkin on the bottom. Best moments, daily details, and all those go right here in this pocket. We turn it over and I sealed this side of the envelope. I used a piece of scrapbook paper. It's made this very sturdy. So we have a waterfall. This is called a waterfall. And the back page has a pocket tuck and it is a collage. So I put down the tuck and then I collaged the area. We have a name, a name card, a place card, and then a tag I made using the um, Hobby Lobby punch. So you have pages to um, to write on and pages to add pictures if you wanted. I usually like to make my flip books to be almost like they could be a mini album that you could use for scrapbooking or document, you know, documenting things. Okay, so you get some page flags, uh, the word glorious. You get this little embellishment here some green labels, a red heart. This says the greatest day and this one is plain and a couple of gold doilies. So they're in this pocket. So this pocket is on the front page of the um, of the waterfall. This one says, I love fall. You open up, you've got the ampersand or and sign. And you can write here. You can also tuck things in there. You can write, put pictures. So here we have a flip out. And this is washi taped to the last envelope. You have a tag and a couple of hearts here. A little ticket collage that says embrace down here. You have a large pocket here with the four by four card and you get a Julie Nutting paper doll and a matchbook style tag in this little pocket. Whee! There she goes. Okay, this one has a belly band and we have this tag and you can pull it down and you can put, um, you can document in here, you can write, journal, um, put pictures, whatever you want to do there. And then we have another pocket and this one has postcards, autumn skies and apple pies, grateful and thankful. 
Be grateful always. Happy fall, y'all. Sweater weather. Not today. <laughs> Pumpkin spice and everything nice. So those are in this pocket. And that flips over. And that flips like this. And then this is the back. And I signed it. So that is the flip book for this swap. And then I just tied it with some ribbon that I just picked up in Michael's in one of the last hauls. And, um, and I like the plaid. I think it's kind of fun. So there we go. So next you are to pick, uh, or you're supposed to make four other embellishments. So you have the choice of either four paper clips or four clothespins. I chose to do four paper clips. We'll have to do something about that. So these were pieces of scraps that were left on my desk after I was all finished and one of the hearts. So I went ahead and I made a card and it is holding the four paper clips. So I have a ticker, ticket paper clip. You can see there's the back of it. It is on a ticket with some background paper, the words Happy Fall, some of the leaves, the bling, kind of the same theme that's been going on throughout this project. This one has the ribbon and I've attached it with fabric tack up at the top so there's like, it's not super bulky. There's not like, you know, where you would tie a knot. But then I went and added a button. <laughs> So that's that one. This one has some of the fuzzy yarn and I've taken it and made it not, um, I unraveled it. And so we have that. And then I added a bead charm to it and that is our third paper clip. The fourth paper clip is one of the large hearts and it is has this little wreath that I made out of the the leaves the small wired leaves and I added a little bow and so and it's on one of those paper clips so that is the four paper clips and I've put it in this packaging and then put it inside here and this card of course could be used as a card and then it was it was just tied with from top to bottom <clears throat> because the side has the card or the the packaging for the um, uh, what is it paper clips. So there's that. So next we were to make a little banner. It needed to be ATC size or bigger and have six car or six panels and I made mine that says fall. So um, I thought it was it turned out pretty. I added lace to the bottom. I stitched around where the cards were added. Um, these ones have the gourds on the inside. These ones have the gourds on the outside. These have the stripes on the outside and the stripes are on the inside. I added the hearts to the two end ones and all of them have the washi tape and then the letters came out of one of the new um, the new Michaels um, uh, hot buys. It's the Autumn Dream. This one is the is where I got those. And I also got the page um, that had the words on it from there. So let me show you. This is the page. I've cut some off of it. But you can see it has all the words. And so I've cut the little words and added them. Added? Yeah. Autumn. Uh, acorns. Bear trees, harvest, apple picking, and pumpkins. So, 
that is the little banner that I made. These are fun to have around your house, like across a bookcase or your mantle, kitchen window. Um, they're just fun to have, I think. So that is part of this swap. Um, next, I you could either do uh, three ATCs or three memory decks cards. I chose to do the three ATCs and I put them in the the protective covering, the trade card covering. And so it kind of is like a mini pocket letter, but really it's the three ATCs. So the first one, I added the heart and I sewed around it, added the flower collage, this piece of ribbon and the happy fall and some washi tape. This one, I, there's washi tape and the word down here that says light breeze, small words going all the way around the outside border or as a border, some bling and a piece of the ribbon going across with the word um, happy fall and the big green dot and that was the last one I actually got to use something up yay um, here I um, used the the oh gosh what is that cool ribbon or cool material when material has these dots I can't think of what it's called but anyway these dots are raised on this um, scrapbook paper and I added the stripe like I've been using throughout bare trees light breeze and then this cute little guy and I just fussy cut him out of a notepad that I had on the back I gave her some goodies um, some ribbon that was in my stash some hearts and some words that were also in my stash so um, we give thanks for all our blessings. Happy Thanksgiving. So she can use those in something that she's doing or for herself. And then I just tied it with this gold um, floss, not floss, but it's a gold uh, string. And then we can just tie it. And she'll be able to use the gold string. Now the ATC cards, you could put them onto another card and have a card if you needed a card. So there's that. So next I made the three tags. They're to be at least three by five. I've used this Tim Holtz um, packaging to put them in because Everything I had was not big enough, and this was right here because I had gotten a stamp set that I'm not going to put back in this packaging, so might as well use it for this. So the three tags are in here, and this one is sewn on. It has ribbon at the top, some of the gold doily here. And fall, some more gold doily, washi tape, the flower um, cluster here with some ribbon. The next one says autumn leaves. It has the cute little squirrel, some of the bling, some washi. The leaves are falling down. And um, some, well, some more of the bling. So, and then the ribbon at the top and I've just fed the ribbon through the hole and then stapled it down so that it can be more flat and then we have a square tag again it's been tied down or sewn so um, and then the word fall leaves has been brought out along with some washi tape some bling this is a fussy cut out leaf and then I added some ribbon some flat ribbon to the top here so that is the three tags so that is my extravaganza I did three tags three ATC's the little banner 
the four paper clips, the flip book, and the pocket letter. I'd love to know which one was your favorite. And are you swapping? Um, do you do happy mail? I'd love to know that too. Find something to celebrate every day. Don't forget to subscribe and have an amazing day. Thank you for being here. Bye.